Hello ladies and gentlemen, Marauder X here, back with more Let's Play Panzer Dragoon Saga. One thing that I want to show off is what I did. I did some power leveling off screen. This was my last save on the top, uh, 223, level 13, 244, in 21 minutes, I got 5 levels. <laughs> those, uh, those little things in the desert... Oh, they are fantastic. They were giving me about a level of fight for a while. So, yeah, that's that's what's going on there. Let's pet the dragon. Always pet the dragon. Always check with the dragon, see what's going on. And we're going to leave. Because we're done here. And I, I could keep leveling. I could keep power leveling. But at this point, I'm already well above where I need to be for this area, so not going to worry too much about it. If I might still be able to go back and power level some more, but I don't think it's going to be needed. So we're going to head here to the Forbidden Zone, and we see what looks like some sort of jellyfish machine. And we have been detected. We are technically a bioweapon, so we just happen to be the ultimate bioweapon. Dragons are the 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 ultimate creature in the Panzer Dragoon universe. So Sky Transporter has been taken offline. What we have to do here um, is reactivate those little devices. Here we have all of this little stuff that's supposed to tell us about the uh, evolution of the dragon and how we can shift forms. All the stuff that I've already gone over: type select, uh, relation and growth. Uh, type specific berserks, which are the the full gauge class skill. Uh, nothing, nothing we really need to worry about. So what we are doing here is we have a save point directly above us, and then we have this thing right behind us that we want to activate. We're gonna have to do this for each and every one of those little things that came off the weird jellyfish machine. So. It's going to take us a little while, and this place is just going to be filled with random encounters, if I remember correctly. So, it's not going to be a fast process. And as you can see, there are treasure chests scattered all over this place. So, we're going to be going after those as well. And the first of many battles. I love it. Thankfully, there's a save point here, so... We're really not in any sort of uh, immediate danger. So, new creature here, the Lazra. And, as you can see, they have a very unique feature. They have intruder removal system and they have an evasion system. The evasion system means we cannot target them with the dragon's lasers. They will evade each and every shot. However, our gun they seem to be less capable of evading. Now that that's gone, we can just take them out even more quickly. They will eventually drop the evasion system. It's not not a terrible threat. However, they can pack quite a nasty punch, so be careful trying to take them head on at, at all. They are They are a threat. Actually, I don't know if they would be a threat to me now, but they could be. Alright, so the joyful thing about this game is that it exists in only certain directions. So I think there's six of those little things that we need to find. We've already got two, so we have more Lazra. These are the skimmers. They will fly on top, or uh, kind of skid on top of the water. And then, as you can see, some of them went under the water, meaning we cannot target them at all. And they seem to be immune to my gun. How are they immune to my gun? They should not be immune to the gun. Okay. And that's their attack, Energy Sphere. They really should not be immune to my gun. I don't like that. And fine then, we'll just 
shoot all of you and then the ones who are below the water will have to come up above the water. We'll take this opportunity to refill our gauges. However, how am I still healed? I'm at 885 HP, but they did damage to me. Alright, so they have a weak point. Not that it really matters, because we're just going to be really just taking them out from a distance. So, things that don't matter, those things. Not really a threat. Well, actually, they are they're sadly more of a threat, because they are even harder to... Uh, Harder to hit. Alright, so there's another one of those things off in the distance. It must be eight instead of six. Also, while uh, traipsing around the desert... Oh, hey, look! Field map! That's wonderful. I did find two treasure chests that I did not get the first time. So, uh, remember, draw distance is a thing in this game, so you want to be careful about that. Alright, so it looks like each one of those uh, cross-shaped cross -shaped sections represents that there's something that we need to access in that area. So we're just going to keep going around and then circles here and getting into more fights. This place would be way more scary if I were not the ridiculous level that I am. Alright. We really do not want to be in front of them. That's where their weak points are, but we don't want to be in front of them. They do have weak points here, but as you can see, it's a little eh, because you don't want to... You're the one with this, the intruder removal system. Uh, if you notice, one has uh, a horn that seems to be larger and more you know, vicious looking. That would be... Uh, the one you need to take out so that you can attack them from behind. And we're already level 19. That's... Ah. Uh, no kill like overkill, is there? Alright, we're just gonna keep flying around, getting some treasure chests, accessing these things. Uh, the treasure chests that I found in the desert, really not anything worthwhile. There was, I think, a Berserk Micro in one of them. So, yeah, not not terrible, but not great that I missed them in the first place. So, yeah. Alright. You think you're being clever. But that's not how this works. Because I'm smarter than you are. And lasers. Everyone gets a laser. And dead. It's amazing, you know, even the last time I let's played this game, I had trouble with some of the 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 fights. But it's it's so much different sitting here going, okay, now I can put two and two together and realize this is what needs to happen for this to happen and that enemies have gimmicks. And if you can analyze the enemy gimmick, you really won't have too much of a problem. I still need to figure out what the, uh, the skimmer's gimmick is. I haven't figured that one out. Well, maybe that's the gimmick. Maybe they're just completely useless. I'm banking on that being the case, because now... I'm done. Oh, you are just not wanting to die, so go away. Excellent. Yeah, I w was, as I was power leveling, I was sitting here going, you know, I really wish I had an idea of how, how much XP it took to level up instead of just the, the gauge. And I would love to not be in a fight every two seconds. That is one thing that I, I gotta say I'm not quite a fan of in this game, is the, the random encounter rate is just a bit silly. Alright, 
hitting me with energy sphere. Did 33 points of damage to me. I know they've hit me before. So, why am I still alive? Or, why am I at my normal health again? What's happening? How am I regening health? Is it the fact that I'm normal? The normal form? That doesn't sound right. I'm I'm confused. Like I was just sitting here talking about how I, I know how this this works, and now I'm confused about what's working, because it's it's doing stuff that I'm not expecting it to. Not that I'm gonna you know look a gift horse in the mouth, but I just don't know how I'm regenerating. It kind of makes me want to take a hit just to see what's going on. And I think I'm going to do that. Because I'm, I'm curious now. Why am I regenerating? I don't have, like, an action replay or anything, so I don't have any codes. Alright. Ray Blast. Alright, that did a fair bit of damage. 139. How am I regenerating? I'm really confused at the moment. It's doing damage to me. What? One forty. Okay. I'm. I I I don't know. I got nothing. None of this makes sense. So. Maybe it's the enemy type I'm fighting? That doesn't make sense either. Yeah, close call, I know. I... normal type? I don't... I'm... I'm really confused. I'm gonna have to look into this. Because this is something that does not happen that I know of. Alright, so... Treasure chest... And another fight. I'm... It can't be that I'm that high a level. I don't think I have anything that, you know, automatically regens. Unless it's an item that I've got, but I don't think I have any items that would do that. This is just... It, I'm... I'm well beyond confused. So... It's... It's just weird. I'm sure someone's going to point out in the comments, like, oh, it's because of X, and I'm like, oh, well, I should have been paying attention. I have no idea why. So, level up to 20. Fabulous. <laughs> we have... We, we have a lot of, of Berserks now. Alright, uh, let's see. Let's check the map. We have been around in a circle. Let's head to the device, shall we? Should be this way. Uh, there we go. Something to access there. That should be the last one. Yep, that is the last one. And now we activate it. Oh, just one more. Where did I miss? I missed this one. Okay. So that would be this one. And the last one is done. Transport seal is broken. Commence reactivation. And now things are working out again. It's making me a little dizzy, for one. Alright, so... Yeah, let's go save it. Where's the save point? South. This way. There it is. We're gonna save it because... This stuff's gonna get real fun real fast. And I think I've got enough time for it, but I'm not 100% sure. Save there. Uh, so in the meantime, I'm going to show off the other berserks that we've got. Uh, where are they? Berserk list. 
We have Chain Laser, Laser Storm, and Prism Laser, Focus Blast of Energy. Judgment Day, really big uh, Holy Sphere. Heal Maxis, which recovers a ton of HP. Wraith Slashers, and we already have all this. I have actually not shown off any of these, so let's get into a fight, can we? Now that I want to get into a fight, it's not going to let me, is it? There we go. We're going to show off all of these abilities. And this way I can just reload the save so that uh, I don't have to worry about regaining the BP for it and just, you know, have some fun. Alright, you want to operate the evasion system? You go right ahead. This is going to be fun. We're just going to go down the list. We have not seen... Oh, no. If We've seen Chain Laser. Let's do Laser Storm. And... Basically Lightning is what that one does. And I'm kind of a fan of it. And they have Laser Storm as well. Okay. And I'm not regenning this time. Maybe it's because I don't have full BP? Ah, maybe that's it. Maybe that's it. Uh, let's see. Let's do Prism Laser now. And it just goes around and does damage. Close call. Yeah, I'm sure it was really a close call. The reason why I'm doing this is because we've got a boss fight coming up, and I really don't want to jump into the boss fight and have to end in the boss fight, so I'm going to just show off abilities while I have the chance. This episode might be a minute or two longer waiting on these fights to show up. But it's better than ending in the middle of a boss fight. Except now I'm not getting into any fights at all. Just bloody brilliant, isn't it? When I want a fight, I get nothing. When I don't want a fight, I'm tripping over them every five seconds. Alright, well, I guess I'll just have to show these off later. I've got a, you know, a couple minutes, but it seems like I'm not getting into anything. Like, come on. There we go. That's fabulous. Showing off those. Lazara. I am really curious to know now if having full BP is what was causing me to uh, regen. I'm gonna. T I'm probably gonna test that one off, uh, off screen. Uh, when I reload the save, where I'll have full BP. All right. Let's see. We haven't seen Cleansing Wave. And... Cleansing Wave's fun. I kinda like it. It's just a really big AoE. It's really pretty. Um, okay, you can laser storm me all you want. I don't care. I am, however, not going to stick around for you to do that, so... And we get to see... Judgment Day. What the Terminators were fighting for. It's basically two Holy Spheres. They just get bigger. So. That's that's really all there is to it. Alright. Um, I could do Heal Maxis. I mean, the heals and the Heal Maxis, that's really all they do. Vengeance Orbs is really useful in a boss fight, so I'll show that. And then we haven't seen... Wraith Slashers is just a bigger version of Phantom Slashers. So... I guess that's where I'll, I'll cut it for there, because that's everything that we can see. So I will see you guys in the next installment, uh, where we will deal with the boss. So till then, later everyone.